Hey guys, uh, welcome. Uh, let's talk about gaming mice. Now, right here I have uh, the Logitech G102 LightSync. This is an entry level gaming mouse. It costs about uh, 1500 bucks. And I believe this is not just for gamers but pretty much for anyone. Uh, here's why. Now, firstly, starting with the price, like I said, it's 1500 bucks, not crazy expensive uh, for the kind of performance that it offers. But let's get the specs out of the way. It has uh, RGB lighting, so 16.8 million colors and uh, 6 programmable buttons, so 2 on the side, uh, 4 on the top with a DPS actor in the middle and uh, if it is like pretty lightweight, it's 84 grams and uh, the sensor, it can go up to 8000 dpi Now realistically, like gamers are not going to use 8000 dpi, especially in FPS games uh, so generally you tend to set it around 800 to 1000 dpi but um, that number 8000 indicates the kind of sensitivity that this mouse can you know uh, take in so like pretty much it can track even the most minute movements so that's what uh, it signifies and uh, let's talk about the feel of uh, using this mouse this mouse actually feels really good to use it offers very accurate tracking and uh, i noticed a very significant improvement in my aim um, i play apex legends and uh, I think it's suitable for anyone with uh, small, medium or large hands for that matter. Um, but ultimately it depends on your personal preference, uh, what kind of mouse you want to choose. But this compared, compared to uh, other mice from Logitech such as uh, G502, uh, this particular mouse is uh, smaller in size and that might or might not be a good thing depending on your personal preference. Now we have to discuss the reliability of this particular mouse. Um, I've been using the G100S from Logitech for the past four years until very recently uh, the left click stopped working. Um, but as far as the re reviews are concerned on Amazon, uh, a lot of people have been complaining that uh, there is a double click issue uh, with this particular mouse or with this particular model that tends to show up within even seven months of usage. <clears throat> that happens when you are uh, a rough user or a heavy gamer uh, but as far as I am concerned I have been using this mouse for, a one, for about one month and I have not faced any issues so far but this is a caveat that you have to keep in mind uh, so if you are somebody who uses your mouse in a very rough manner then I think you would have that left click issue that is when you click it once it registers as uh, a double click I generally trust Logitech with a build quality I think the button click feels good uh, the scroll wheel feels tight and uh, uh, the side buttons though they, uh, compared to the buttons on the top the side buttons feel a little bit you know, flimsy but uh, that's not really a big deal because it doesn't take much effort to press and that is sort of more important than uh, the buttons feeling rigid so who would I recommend this mouse to? Uh, I think anybody could actually get this mouse and uh, be very happy with it that is because firstly it doesn't cost much second it offers excellent tracking so uh, it helps when you are a workaholic generally when you are a person who is focused on productivity let's say video editing or music production for that matter that's what i do um, i feel like this mouse uh, offers excellent tracking and that is really important when you keep clicking on stuff and i use a laptop with a relatively smaller screen so um, i tend to navigate a lot and click on things a lot and so for that, this mouse is just perfect. But yes, there are other mice uh, from other brands like Red Gear which are relatively cheaper and offer similar specs. But with Logitech, it is simply the brand value and the warranty and the reliability. And also, it, it has the best RGB lighting that you can get in and around this price. Uh, the quality of the lighting is good if that's something that you're concerned about. And the click feels good. So. Um, that's why you're paying the price pretty much so thank you so much for watching i hope uh, this video helped so if you have any questions comment down below so thank you see you